Well, Sean and Victoria join me now. And Sean, you were saying it actually this new leg, which I know is still being worked on. You're still you're still going to get there, um, but it feels like part of you. It does much more attached than yeah. than this one, which sort of wallows around. So mm. the moment it's on. Yeah, you just feel, feel more in control of it. Yeah, so that makes rather, perfect you know, sense. And less, yeah. It's so important as well for learning to walk when you've got a better connection with your residual limb sure. um, that you can kind of step on it and it feels like part of you, Because really. you must have found that when you were going through it as well. Yeah, you must no, have definitely. Yeah. And obviously, you know, at the beginning, you're still quite swollen sort of after operation, so the socket has to be continually kind of made smaller and the better fit you have, obviously, the more chance sure. you've got of balancing on it and kind of stepping mm. forward. And that's what Matthew is creating for you like an incredible bespoke socket it's on incredible. this super high-tech leg I mean it's <laughs> amazing he then got his iPad out and starts kind of I saying I'm just going it. to program your knee wow. onto my iPad with the level of resistance Gosh, and everything that's, that's so a feat of engineering it's isn't it? It's amazing remarkable. isn't it it's magic isn't it it's like smoke and mirrors and you just think oh, and this thing vibrates when it sets it off and you think wow. right I'm yeah off. it's still yeah and your Very face wonderful. was just <laughs> amazing. I mean, I just sort of burst into tears. I think it is, as you said, it's the first time you've felt like you've got your leg back. Okay. Yeah. Yes, it, yeah. it does. Definitely. And, it, and, yeah, those first few steps, because they forced me to walk without the stick. We did. Bullied me into that. Oh, that's a big deal, Sean. Just those steps yep. were incredible. Yeah. I can't quite, can't quite believe it, so, mm. you know. Yeah. But it... Res you know, that gives you the resistance like a normal leg when you take the mm. step and I could really see the start of they've told me I have to walk before I can run and slow yeah. no, down of course, manage of my course. expectations but that's okay but that's okay it's slowly really baby steps so yeah. slowly, slowly. can I see you are looking so much better Am I? Yes. I must have been looking awful before. No, not at all. No, it's just everything. I mean, I know you've lost weight. I know that's I part have. of the whole I'm thing. I'm still you've working, working on that. You've been working really hard. It's not easy. We all know how difficult that is. It's, and sometimes, you know, you fall off the wagon. That's OK. That's all right. You just get back on it again. But it's everything. Your eyes are sparklier. Yeah, <laughs> Thank I agree. You. I think it... you're getting yourself back, if you know what I mean. Oh, totally. <laughs> you look like a completely different person to yeah. the one that first came on the sofa. It's... It's called turn it around, isn't it? And uh, <laughs> I mean, uh, and it really, but it really has made mm. that kind of that difference to me. I mean, it only started really in February, didn't it? That's true. Yeah. And we're only, yeah. you know, here it is in May, yeah. and already the impact. And I haven't got the leg yet. Yeah. Yep. You know, I never dreamt that I would get mm. something like that. But and already the impact it's had on me as a just as a person and my sure. outlook and things that I want to do taking forward mm. and things that I'm looking at doing outside of. My normal life, which it's I would great. never have done. No, it's so good. Fantastic. Just wonderful. Yeah. And, and the leg just... will be, I mean, obviously, you know, there's still a lot of work to be done on it. But yes. You reckon maybe in a month it might I be? I would hope, I have fingers crossed, but because these things take time, but I would hope by the end of June, yeah. I've got my fingers crossed that I will have the leg. Yes. Yeah. So, the, so hopefully the next time you see me, you'll be away. I'll be yes. running around the studio. You'll be away. It'll we'll be have great. It, have it for the summer, which will be so exactly. lovely. Yes. Right? That'll be brilliant. Because these things take time. This is a real, you know, as we do. said, it's yeah. a feat of engineering. And that's what I was be... trying to say to you at the beginning, wasn't it? It's like you've got to be patient because it's not going to fit perfectly, and it might cut you in certain yeah, areas, you and just then you have, have to, to expand of course, it. Of course, of course, of course. But you know, we get in there. We get good at patience, us amputees. We are. We are good at patience. Some better than others, I think. Good things come to those who wait. Yeah, but it's so this story. is really the next huge, huge, massive step. The big, leap. On the, big leap. A big really, leap, not a step. The, yeah, <laughs> actually, on this journey, and that's fantastic. It's going to be good. Wonderful. Well, look, we'll see you soon. Well, thank you. We will see you soon, Sean. Just keep up the good work, obviously. And, and Victoria, you do yeah. a, a great yeah. job as mentor. Well, I'm loving working with him. It's brilliant. Good, absolutely brilliant. Excellent. Thank you both no, very much indeed. Thank you.